For Comedy Hive News, I'm John Oppo. Well, it looks like Cat Williams is continuing his three-hour podcast tour because on Thursday, he would make an appearance on Joe Rogan's podcast, The Joe Rogan Experience. As stated at the top of the conversation, this would be the first time the two comedians would meet one another. What makes this interview even more interesting, if you remember just over a month ago when Cat stopped by Shannon Shop's Club Shay Shay podcast, he would state that the majority of comedians invited on Rogan's podcast weren't funny. That would be like me being on Joe Rogan. Joe don't want me on there. Joe got six comedians that never been funny. He want to push out. <laughs> <laughs> After those comments were made, Rogan would tweet that he would love to have Cat on the show. Fast forward to today and their three hour conversation discussion would touch a multitude of topics, most centering around conspiracy theories, even touching on the building of the pyramids, the creation of the universe, the amount of books he's read, UFO, aliens, and so much more. Now the energy and tone of the interview would be a complete 180 from the tone of Kat's Club Shay Shay interview, which took place several weeks before. Early in their talk, it would be revealed that Cat Williams has an electric Rolls Royce. This would lead to a conversation towards other self-driving cars, where Rogan would theorize that automated self-driving cars will be mandatory within 100 years from now. He would elaborate by saying the people in charge will say this method will stop crashes and highway thefts in order to get the general public to abide. They will use this reasoning. Cat's response, all of these things have financial benefits and they use those perks you just mentioned to get you in. I believe that if it will be mandatory, but for practical reasons, like this thing where the police want you and they have to chase you and you may get away, those days are done. Yeah, they're just gonna shut your car off. Your car is going to do what they tell it to do, which is get behind this patrol car and follow us to the station. Now, interesting enough, Rick Ross would also have the same thoughts literally about a year ago when he would admit that he was afraid to drive a Tesla because that the government may hack into it. I've never ridden in a Tesla and the reason being is because I've always had in the back of my mind the government could tap into the brain of the car. Yeah. Now, bring him in for questioning. <laughs> now, as of this report, Kat's first interview with Joe Rogan has already received 1 million views in four hours. Let's talk about him in the comments below. What's been one of the craziest things you've heard Cat Williams say that could be true? And for more news in comedy, be sure to subscribe here to our YouTube channel and follow Comedy Hype across all social media. Plus, head over to thehypemarket.com for all your cool and original merchandise. And for our YouTube viewers, if you enjoyed this report, don't forget you can send us a super thanks by hitting the button below and tip us what you want to show your support. For Comedy Hype News, I'm John Hopper.